My ex Dominic's girlfriend, Jasmine, keeps accusing us of sleeping together. Jasmine stepped in on me and Dominic's relationship. We have been together for five years. We have three children together. She ended up calling me when she was around six months pregnant and asking me if me and Dominic were still messing around and if we had broken up. And I explained to Jasmine that we never stopped messing around. We stopped having sex about a little bit over a year ago. I just got tired of the back and forth. I feel like, you know, I'm, play, I'm selling myself short. He having his cake and he's eating it too. He tells me that he loves me, he wants to be with me, but then he also tells me that he has love for Jasmine. So I feel like he wants to have both of us. Like if he could move both of us in a house together, that he would do it. Today I want Jasmine to stop the accusing, the allegations, and just be happy. Like uh, you got him, if you want him, keep him. If, if not, then move on. And then just quit accusing us of sleeping together because it's gonna happen. You come home at five in the morning after I called you 30 damn times. Are you serious? If you have a, a young woman with two small children at home, why are you out that late? You won't even have sex with me. Why? Why, why I won't? Why? why I won't? When we do try, why what you I tell won't? me? Three minutes. Three minutes? Why I get three I minutes. Why won't you have sex with him? Because you think he's him. sleeping with he somebody bring, else. Ain't no telling what he could bring me home. You have kids with her, right? Well, you do or you don't. No. <laughs> she said you had three kids with her. That's something I got to tell her, too. They not mine. For real, though? Okay. You gave her the impression that they was, that, was my that, kids. So did you use that excuse to go over there? Yeah. Why fight over one guy? I let him go. It ain't even a... Yeah, but she you said keeps, you still want him. I, I still love him. I would like to be with him if she could get out the picture. <laughs> I had him first. She stepped in on my relationship. Not gonna happen. I, exactly. You telling her that Not now. You saying that because she right here. Not gonna But then happen. you always tell me you still want to be with me. You happen. love me. Come on now. And you standing there looking stupid as Oh, well. <laughs> you know what's going to happen after we read this lie detector test? You know what's going to happen? It's going to happen. Absolutely nothing. You'll go home or tonight and you'll go, oh, baby, I'm sorry. And, you know. She do it all the time. And then he's <laughs> going to come back by you and, oh, baby, I, you know I still love you. And I'm and, the only one that and, left. You never right, left. Like, you know, You're the only right. one that left? I know. Am I you <laughs> He came here to take a lie detector test, okay? But we didn't have to do all that. You know why? Because he baby, confessed. He's a man. Oh, you told the truth finally? Do you want to know what he confessed to? The subject confessed to having sexual contact intercourse with Deirdre just over a year ago. He also confessed to having sex with the girl he met in a bar over the past year. Damn. Furthermore, within the past month, he did have sex with the girl so he met at a strip club. Somebody <laughs> else too? I'm glad you came on. I'm really the... But like... If you're just gonna give it up, why don't you just give it up at home? That's right, why and we have to come she on wants TV? To come on show. Usually, in, in these stories, there's at least one happy person. <laughs> there's nobody, 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 nobody happy ever been happy in this situation. Except me. Exactly, who made you this damn situation? Right ain't nobody you. been happy.